for some reason I don't remember that headstone but this one I clearly always remembered from my youth and um, once again it is buried down in the ground nowadays somebody tried to dig it out this will give you a really good example as to how far down into the ground this actually is right now and again that was at level when I was a kid I guess somebody put this fence around it so that we could find it because the floods would just take it away otherwise. This area, I don't remember it being fenced off. It looks like the state has come in and maybe taken over some areas. I can remember as a kid, our family walking through here. There are walking trails. Some properties look like they're only being used at certain times. Other properties, like I said, are either gone or have just turned into little RV lots where people bring that type of stuff. All of our yards were this beautiful white sand when I was a kid. I can remember walking, squishing my toes in it. We had our own store that had um, a little boat ramp and people would come in. It's where I got my hair cut. It was called Harvey and Barrels. My mom painted the ice cold beer signs for the uh, river people that were coming by. It was such a popular area. And then, like I said, Mother Nature, she's a bitch. She just took what was hers back. And that is definitely what has happened here. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video at Swanee River Campsite. I am somewhere in Jasper, Florida, right on the Swanee River. It's all dirt roads, and it's been raining. So the sun is back out. You have a great day, and thank you for watching.